how much does this actually have to do with the coronavirus and how much is the coronavirus providing nice cover for the Chinese government to be able to do this? That's a great point, and we don't know why now is the time that the governor of Hainan is trying to do this, but HNA has been in trouble for some time. They narrowly avoided default last year, and they just have huge bills to pay, and they really need some solution. And it's not just them. There could be other conglomerates in China that have been struggling with their debt loads that could see maybe China come in in light of the effort they're trying to stabilize the economy right now. Who could be a potential buyer here for some of these assets? So far, the Chinese government would be a good place to look because they have said that they're looking to stabilize the economy right now. So that's definitely a place to look. Uh, U.S. buyers in light of the national security concerns and the tensions are probably not uh, a place to look for logical buyers here. How politically palatable will it be? I mean, will it come as a relief to many in China that this happens? Will Beijing pull the plug on it? Will it go ahead? It's not totally surprising. A lot of these companies are already very close to the Chinese government. It's unclear how much relief it will provide. Uh, some of these assets are private, some are public. Hainan Airlines is publicly listed. It has a $3.8 billion market cap, so maybe there's some movement in that stock today. But otherwise, this is a big private conglomerate, so we aren't exactly sure who will benefit here.